Hey there, in this video we will see how to set up Query Builder Control for MongoDB database. Query Builder Control comes in hand when we need to filter data according to certain conditions on the server side. If you frequently need to filter large data sets with thousands of records in order to gain new insights, then this control may be a very good option for you. So let's get started. In your app screen, go to the controls, search for the Query Builder Control, then drag it to the screen. Now to fetch the data, we need a table grid control. Search it in the controls and drag it to the screen. After arranging both the controls, let's connect the table grid control with the MongoDB database. Select the table grid and click on the data option. Then select the connectors. You will see various database connectors you can connect your app with. Let's select MongoDB connector. Now you can see few data input fields. Give your connector a name. Then you can see there is a connection string field which you can get from your MongoDB account. Now there is an input field that is database name. You need to make sure you put the correct name of the database as per mentioned in the MongoDB database. After filling all the details, now enable whitelist IP and test connection. The connection is successful and your connector is now added. Now click on the add query. You can see there is a collection field where all the collections available in your MongoDB database will be displayed. We have sample customers as a collection. Now give name to your query. Test your connection and once it's successful you will be able to see your data in the output. Now in the filter field you need to add a variable. And in the right side, you can see the variable is getting created. Now test and save and your query will be added. Now go to your database connector and you can see the query that you created. Select your query. Now in the data input fields, you can see the variable you created named as query. Now in this add the query builder control keyword to connect it with the control. Now you get an option to bind columns that you want to get displayed in the table. Select the columns you want. Once you click on test and finish, you will be able to see your MongoDB data right here in the table grid. Now after adding query builder control keyword in the table grid, go to query builder properties and you will see the schema section. Make sure you add the right label names, value and the type as per the data in your database. Now let's preview. You can add the rule based on your criteria. You can see all the column names. Select name, provide the condition. Let's say our condition is country equal to Australia. Click on apply and now you can see the data is filtered and only the records with country Australia are shown. With query builder control you can add many conditions using the AND and OR operators and also perform various calculations like less than, greater than and equal to and many more and run complex queries within seconds.